What if I told you that a new digital frontier is unfolding right now and you don't need to be a coder, a blockchain expert, or a millionaire to take part in it? Imagine a blockchain that's not just for tech elites, but for everyone. A network with over 60 million users and it's growing every single day. And now, for the first time ever, developers, yes, even complete beginners, are being invited to build the future on this massive platform. Wealth Warriors, welcome to the Pi Network Revolution. In this video, I'm going to break down how you can start building apps on Pi Network, even if you've never written a line of blockchain code in your life. We'll explore the real-world tools you'll use, the economic model behind Pi, and the game-changing acquisition that just sent shockwaves across the crypto world. So stay with me because what you're about to hear could be your gateway into the future of decentralized income. Before we dive in, do me a favor, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and drop a comment that says, I'm building with Pi. Let's show the world that wealth warriors are ready to lead the charge into Web3. Let's start with this. Pi Network isn't your typical blockchain project. While most blockchain ecosystems are designed by and for hardcore developers, Pi Network was built with the average person in mind a mobile-first inclusive platform with the goal of creating a truly people-powered digital economy. Right now, Pi boasts a community of over 60 million pioneers. These are real users who are already mining Pi on their mobile phones, engaging with decentralized applications and contributing to a network built on trust, usability, and community value. And here's the exciting part. Pi is not asking you to become a blockchain genius overnight. They've created a developer-friendly ecosystem that allows web developers, just like you, to start building apps using tools you're already familiar with. No need to learn Solidity, no need to become a smart contract wizard, no crypto wallet headaches. Instead, Pi offers a JavaScript and TypeScript-based SDK that you can plug right into your front-end and back-end code to interact directly with Pi wallets, user authentication, and transactions. Let that sink in. This is one of the first real chances in crypto where everyday developers and entrepreneurs can build, launch, and earn in a blockchain ecosystem without going through the usual tech chaos. So how does it actually work? The Pi Network supports app development using web tools you likely already know and use. On the front end, you can use React or Vue.js to create progressive web apps. These are apps that run smoothly on both desktop and mobile browsers perfect for Pi's mobile-first user base. On the back end, you can choose Node.js or Python with frameworks like Flask or FastAPI. That means you don't have to learn any exotic languages. You can build using the exact same tech that powers thousands of modern websites and services. Now here's where it gets interesting. Using the PI SDK, developers can access blockchain features without needing smart contracts. You can connect to Pi user wallets, authenticate identities, and even verify and process payments all inside your app. This means you can build full-service applications, e-commerce, content platforms, service marketplaces, even games that use Pi as the currency. No fiat conversions, no waiting on exchange listings, just pure peer-to-peer -peer digital transactions inside a secure ecosystem. And when you're ready to go public, the Pi Developer Portal lets you test your app, submit your MVP, and launch directly to millions of Pi users inside the Pi browser. It's one of the cleanest onboarding paths for Web3 devs in the world right now. But let's be real. With great access comes great responsibility. The Pi Core team doesn't just hand out development rights to anyone. There are important rules and ethical requirements you must meet before you can publish your app. First, every developer must go through full KYC verification. That's know your customer and it's designed to ensure accountability and transparency in the ecosystem. Second, your app must provide a clear privacy policy and user agreement. That builds trust with users and ensures you're playing by the rules. Third, and this is big, your app must provide real utility and use Pi as a medium of exchange. You can't build gambling platforms, no adult content, no shady referral pyramids. The Pi ecosystem is about building real value, not just hype, and that's what makes it so powerful. Because the more real apps that use Pi in real ways, the more valuable Pi becomes for the entire network. Imagine this, a tutoring app where students pay in Pi, a language translation service paid for in Pi, or a virtual storefront where digital goods are exchanged in Pi. That's not the future. That's happening now. And you can be part of it. Now let me hit you with something that just made serious waves. Banksa, 
A global payment infrastructure giant has acquired over 30.5 million Pi coins, currently worth about 19 million USD. Let me say that again. A financial tech company trusted by exchanges, institutions, and governments just made a multi million dollar bet on the future of Pi Network. Why? Because they see what many of us already know Pi isn't just a mining experiment, it's a rising digital economy backed by real people, real applications, and soon, real transactions. And get this, Bangza is now allowing users to buy Pi directly and deposit it into their wallets with ease. This could be a tipping point, it signals a maturing ecosystem, and more importantly it shows that institutional confidence in Pi is rising fast. So, what should you build? Here are some of the most powerful starting points if you're looking to enter the Pi developer ecosystem today. 1. Learning platforms. Offer paid courses, tutorials, or community content. Use Pi for micropayments. Simple, scalable, powerful. 2. Service marketplaces. Whether it's writing, translation, tutoring, or consulting, you can offer services and get paid in Pi directly. 3. Digital goods. Skins, avatars, trading cards, and downloadable assets all fit naturally within Pi's closed-loop economy. 4. Mini-games. Fun, addictive games with Pi-based in-app purchases not only engage users, they showcase real utility. 5. AI-integrated tools. Combine your app with AI tools, text, image, voice, video, and you can offer futuristic Pi-powered experiences. This is your sandbox, Wealth Warriors, and the possibilities are endless. But here's the final piece of the puzzle. Open Mainnet. Right now Pi is still operating in a closed environment. This was designed to protect the system as it matured. But with developers ready, with institutions stepping in, and with the community begging for freedom now is the time. Open Mainnet would mean unrestricted access for developers, real-world use cases at scale, and full decentralization. We're almost there. And when it happens, the value of Pi and the ecosystem around it could explode. So if you've ever wanted to be at the start of something big, this is your window. Wealth warriors, listen closely. The world is changing fast, and while some are waiting for permission, others are out here building futures on decentralized rails. The Pi Network is no longer a theory, it's a movement. And you, my friend, are being invited to help shape it. Whether you're a coder, a creator, or just a visionary with an idea, Pi gives you the infrastructure, the tools, and the users to turn your vision into a digital reality. So what will you build? If you made it this far, Type Pi Pioneer in the comments to let me know you're serious about this journey. Don't forget to like the video, share it with someone who needs to hear this, and subscribe for more updates from Uncle G Fintech. Until next time, stay hungry, stay smart, and stay wealth warriors. The future belongs to the builders.